Hey you guys, it's Carol Doll here. I'm back with another video. Yes, I did say I'm back with another video. Today, this video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to be talking about, um, I guess, my new second job or whatever. Okay, so before y'all keep on watching, I need you to do me a favor. I need you to go ahead, smash that subscribe button, smash the like button, turn the post notification bell on so you can be notified when I make my next video so you don't miss a video and you don't miss a beat, you don't miss a video and you don't miss a beat. So, let's get into the video. Okay, so you guys, uh, I told y'all before in my get ready with me for work video that I work at a store, like an older store, but I don't really care for the store. Uh, the reason why I don't really care for the store is because my manager, she is an asshole. I would just say it like that. She's an asshole. Um, not just that. Like, I'm just not really getting the pay that I expected. So, fast forward to this past Sunday, I started uh, DoorDash. For yo for those of you that don't know what DoorDash is, it's like Postmates and Uber Eats. And I'm missing another one. But, yeah. So, basically, it's like people just, they get on the app. Um, there's like different little restaurants and stuff. And they just order what they want. And I am a dasher. Basically, a dasher is I just go out. I get their food. Um, and I bring it to them. Like, it's as simple as that. Like, because I know they have, like, so many other things where you can, like, order your groceries, all kind of stuff like that. But, yeah. So, I'm going to just tell you all about my first day doing that. Uh, Sunday, it was pretty cool. Like, I'm not going to lie. It's pretty cool. So, uh, I had the app. And on the app, it just basically tells you what areas are hot spots. Hot spots are, like, um, where people are mostly ordering from and stuff like that. So, what the best thing I would suggest is go to those hot spots. When you go to hot spots, nine times out of ten, an order is going to pop up. You can accept it or you can decline it or whatever. So, uh, for most of the orders that popped up Sunday, I pretty much accepted them. Uh, some are going to be close to you. Some are going to be not so close to you. So, it's it's really up to you what you want to do. Oh, another thing. The reason why I'm in the car right now is because I'm actually working, per se. But I'm not working alone. I'm working with my girlfriend. Yep, y'all saw her when I did her makeup or whatever. So, uh, t I'm going to get a little bit off track, but not really off track. Anyways, so how we do it is um, I basically drive us out to the popping area. The popping area. We switch. Um, we I'm switch. Okay. I drive us to the popping area. We switch uh, spots. And then I get the passenger seat. She gets in the driver's seat. So she drives me to like these different places. And I hop out, hop back in. Like we have like a system. But if you don't have a girlfriend, boyfriend, friend, family member, or what have you, you can you can do this by yourself. This is something that you can totally do by yourself. But if you're interested in just making some cash, some extra cash like I am, um, I suggest you do it with someone else. Like it's so quick. Because you know, at a lot of these places, it's hard to find freaking parking. Like the places that they have you go to, they're usually like popular places. And the reason why people don't want to drive and get their own food is because one, they, have to get real dark. one they probably have kids. No, this is actually really good lighting. One, they probably have kids. Two, they probably lazy. Three, uh, who wants to wait in line? Like, you could pay to have someone else wait in line for you. Like, anyways, like, it's a pretty cool app. Like, I'm glad I did it. The sign up process is really quick and easy. So if you're a college student like I am, I would highly suggest you sign up for DoorDash because literally I did the app one night and then like the next night, everything was clear. Like, everything was clear. They email you everything. You set up all your stuff. Like, the app is very self-explanatory. Um, in my next video, I think I'm going to wait. So in my next video, I'm going to tell y'all like how much I made the first time. No, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to be one of those people. I'm going to just show y'all right now what like what the app looks like. So that's pretty much what the app looks like. You send me your phone? Yeah. Okay. So that's pretty much what the app looks like. When you go into the app, it looks like this. It's just going to show you like pretty much. It's pretty much freaking map. Like it's a map. All of the red, the red is basically like the the popping areas or whatever all of the adult like right now my area is like not it's terrible so i'm in the gray i'm in the gray right now hence while we're sitting in the car it's 11 11 45 a.m right now um so on this app you can look at the map you can schedule you can schedule your drive you can look at your account information and your account information all that basically your profile uh you put some information about your vehicle but that's very easy like you don't have to insert any insurance information or anything like you literally just put car or truck and go about your day and also the very cool thing and helpful thing about this app is you can use google maps or Waze. i use Waze because that's what i'm used to using so it just helps you navigate your way through uh the next little tab is ratings like on the ratings it's gonna look like this and i'm gonna just read you a couple of mine um I have one of my ratings is 100% uh, acceptance rate. It says uh, acceptance rate is the number of orders you accepted out of the last 100 deliveries because we pretty much accept every freaking order. Consistently accept delivery opportunities to raise your acceptance rate. Yeah. 
And then also, I know if you are familiar with uh, uh, DoorDashers, whatever, we usually wear like a DoorDash shirt, like a red shirt with the DoorDash symbol, and then the red back. Well, on the app, after you sign up and you get cleared, like your background and stuff, like literally the next day, you are clear to start dashing immediately. Like through this app, you can just start immediately. Some places you go into, they may give you a little grief because you don't have your shirt on or whatever, which I think is very stupid because on the app, it tells you who the customer is and what they order and whether or not they paid. So it's like, you can't, you can't get this information. So it's like, if I go in the restaurant and I'm like, uh, I'm picking up an order for Kim. If I say I'm picking up an order for Kim and they're like, what did she order? Like, how am I going to guess she ordered a teriyaki bowl with this, 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 like, you know, some places give you grief, but don't worry about it. I only had one place where the lady was like, next time uh, you need your bag and your shirt. I was just like, okay, woman, give me the food so I can get to work. Anywho. All the other places that I went to, they didn't care. They didn't care. They were just like, who are you picking up for? All that. So our first day doing DoorDash, we did seven orders. We did seven orders. And I'm actually going to go to my... This is how much we made. We made $45.57. $45.57. And I think when I click on here... Actually, one moment. Okay. It actually tells the seven deliveries. It doesn't say anyone's name, so I can show y'all this. So Willie's six seventy five. That's how much I got paid. Chewy's four sixty three. Wings and more six oh six. National Treasure Restaurant six eighty three. Firehouse Subs five fifty eight. Nukes Eatery eight forty two. Alicia's Mexican Grill seven twenty six. So the prices are gonna. I would say the prices usually range between like four and eight dollars. And also another thing is some people may tip you cash. So I wouldn't worry about this. I wouldn't worry about this too much. But yeah. I wouldn't worry about this too much. Um, but the app is pretty cool. Not just the app. They also send you texts. Like, they send you texts. They're like, um, hey, Jakira, welcome to DoorDash. For uh, on-delivery support, please chat with us in the Dasher app. Like, if you need any help, you can always chat. Also, in different locations, they do have a headquarters. Like, if you just really need some help. But the app is pretty self-explanatory because... If I'm not mistaken... Oh, perfect. I can tell you. I signed up for this Wednesday, November 28th. Thursday, I was clear to get on the rope. So, you see pretty much how quick that is. And literally, they give you the steps. Um, step one, download the app. Two, open the app and tap Dash Now to start dashing immediately or schedule the dash later. Three, earn your money. There's three steps. There's all you need. Three, freaking, three freaking steps. That's all you freaking need. My little, um, my stand in here is not freaking sticking because I moved it. So, bear with me. Hold on. It's going to, yeah. Okay, so, I mean, that's pretty much all I'm going to say about my first my first day doing um, DoorDash. Like, I really enjoy it. I like it. I feel like this is something that I'll continue to do, like, off and on, especially until I find a job that is paying me what I feel like I should be getting paid, giving me the hours that I feel like I should be getting, you know. Like I always say, do what you have to do until you can do what you want to do. Okay? Okay. Okay, so if y'all want to see more videos like this, comment down in the comment section. Let me know so I can get those videos out to you. Let me know how y'all liking my Vlogmas videos. Sorry, they're like not Vlogmas. They're like more video -mas. But this one's kind of Vlogmas because I'm out. Okay, I'm out. Anyways, do me a favor. Go ahead, smash the subscribe button, smash that like button, turn this post notification bell on, and have a good day. She been on my